Hi everyone, this is Deep Singh Earth once again. Welcome back to episode 6 of How to Hack and Turn Shell Lenovo Y50. So, in this episode, I will going to tell how to fix your power management and how to make your audio works. So, first, you will need an internet connection for it, and after that, you will just need to open terminal and copy paste this code which is available uh, in the text file. I will leave all the links of those codes in the description below. You can just copy paste the command in terminal and you will get this prompt you just need to type and to ignore it again you just need to type and again once you're done with that you just need to go to the folder which is this location uh, as you can see on the screen After that you will see some ssdt.dsl files, you just need to double click it and open it in Mac ASLI software which you used previously on a part 5. After that you just need to, just con for confirmation you just need to click on compile and see if there is no error and just need to save it on a patch folder which you can see I'm doing right now there is no error uh, then you just need to mount your system drive in which your all iffy folder of Clover are saved so for that you just need to open con Clover configuration and mount the system drive where all boot records are saved and then you just need to save this SSDT over there which can be done like this You just need to remember that you have to save the file in ACPI format in patch folder instead of the assembling system files which is uh, mandatory if you want to save it as a backup you can save it in the folder but in this tutorial I'm not going to save it as a backup file so I'm just directly uh, saving it in the patch folder in the ACPI format which is a machine language format as I already passed in but uh, I'm doing once more time so I I'm going to replace the SSDT dash one file you just need to remember that you just need to put the name SSDT dash one and save it like this after that you just need to reboot your system and after that uh, you just need to go to link and you will find an audio driver which is voodoo HDA uh, all link will be down in the description below you just need to download as I'm doing right now this is pretty much very easy process After download completion you just need to extract all the files inside the zip file and install the driver which is come which comes in package uh, application format so j this is pretty much a very simple easy to install thing so you just, you just need to click next and install everything according to the software and then your Hackintosh audio will gonna work. So this is all for the part 6 of the tutorial. After this tutorial your Hackintosh will work smoothly with all audio outputs and all kind of power management stuff. So uh, you can expect in the next video that I will going to teach how to add in your Clover boot manualist items and how to triple boot uh, which will include Windows 8, Ubuntu and Mac OS X uh, on the same PC or a laptop you can say so stay tuned for it do subscribe my channel and do like my videos thanks for watching this is deep single from attack point see you in the next one